we have a SonicWall TZ210 here, and I've configured it to listen to router advertisements, which is a little bit funny. So if you look here in the configuration page, I'm going to the WAN port, and if I click this, I can set the WAN port on the Advanced tab to enable listening to router advertisements and perform stateless address auto configuration, which is a kind of strange thing you probably wouldn't really want to do, but if you do it, here's what happens. This thing is listening. Here's some pings to show the effect. Now over here, I've been sending one router advertisement per second, advertising a network starting with 333. And if you look here, you can see it has automatically configured the 333 address, which is what it should do. But if I send a flood over here of thousands of addresses, like this, then the sonic wall is gone. The pings don't answer. This page does not refresh. Now hit refresh up here. It's just dead as a doornail, like the other ones, because it is doing what I told it to. It is listening to all those router advertisements and automatically configuring a bunch of addresses, and it can't handle it. It totally hogs up all the resources of the router. Now if I stop it over here, control C, and come back here, it will recover pretty soon. We can see when the pings answer again. Six, seven, Good, this finally gave up. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, now it's back, 20, about 20 seconds. And the pings answer, and pretty soon the web interface will be back. Okay. Now this is going to take a long time to load, and notice what happens here. The pings are suddenly taking like two and three seconds to answer, then they go back to slow again. The router, now it's going back up to huge numbers again. The processor is having to do a lot of work, and only occasionally has time to pay attention to pings, and then it slows down again. Here's another 1400 response. It's doing waves of heavy duty processing, and you will see the result here when it finally gets done doing an enormous amount of work it will be able to refresh this page and the answer is kind of amusing. So it's worth waiting another few seconds for it to come on. Okay, now it's able to load the page and of course the page has thousands and thousands of new addresses configured. That's what it's spending all its time doing and it's so bad that it's very hard for it to load this page because it's got all that garbage on there. So it has permanently burdened the router with a ridiculous number of addresses. Now, we can restart the router to clean it out, and I think I'll do that, so why don't you just stop this one?